very good. So open and lock and lock and open. Good. So we've got fully functional bedrooms. Um, let's now start digging a little bit further into the mess hall so that it is actually a mess hall. Uh, to make it a mess hall, we do need one thing, uh, which will be furniture. Yeah, water cooler. Um, so where's the midpoint? That's right there. So we'll put that in. And then hopefully we should see that once the water cooler is there, oh, it's already done. Yeah, it's a mess hall. So um, yeah, rooms are really important in this game. They help boost morale. Um, so the better the room is, the more morale it will give. Uh, artwork also does a good job of that kind of stuff as well. Um, we will get into art. Uh, in fact, oh yeah, of course, um, Roy, no, Rambo Chicken is our, yes, our decorator. So let's give Rambo his hat and what are his creativity skills? Only 10 at the moment. We need it at a 14, I believe um to get the really good statues um but our research is complete whatever it was that we last put on oh it was the fine art wasn't it um so let's start thinking about something else and we are gonna want to start thinking about a clean room fairly soon so let's get all the way up to improved plumbing done next so yeah we'll be um pumping this chlorine out of here and creating a little um, clean room in this area. Uh, let's just double check. No germs. Good. Um, oxygen. Eh, I mean, that's not ideal. Ooh, yeah. Oxygen production is a little bit low. Do you know what? I think it's time to open that up so that some of this oxygen can start to uh, seep into the base. Got to imagine that the temperature up here, it's not, it's not terrible, but it's not great either. Definitely need to get some um, insulated tiles up here because that is ridiculously hot. Ridiculously hot. Don't quite have those yet, though. Um, so, in fact, I'm going to switch the research up so that I can get the insulated tiles in because I think that's of greater importance right now. Cool. Go, go, go. Right, looks like they're at the stage where they haven't got much to do as do again, so they're uh, they're actually tidying. So let's uh, let's start thinking about how we're going to do this clean room. Um, we'll put the insulated tiles along there. And in fact, yeah, we might want to do the whole thing with insulated tiles. Um, so yeah, let's just we'll we'll dig out what we can. But let's yeah, let's let's dig out. That would make sense. So we need all of that dug out. Nearly there with the insulated tiles. Come on, Roy. Get researching, my friend. Good. Uh, so we have... No, we don't. Oh, he's got to go and do the advanced uh, research for the insulated tiles now, which will take a little bit longer. Um, good. That... They're digging things out that we need, so that's, uh, that's good.
Now, if we do want to bring in more dupes, we are going to have to have another bedroom set up. So I think another little project that I'll get them going with is uh, digging out this way. And we are going to want all of this swept up eventually anyway. So let's, uh, let's get a head start with it. Um, storage unavailable for phosphorite. I have no idea what we use phosphorite for. Um, Properties we use as bait. No, that's no. Those are just. Uh, hmm. Yeah, not not entirely sure what we can use it for. It's probably just another building material. In fact, can figure that out now. So tiles, sedimentary, granite, igneous, sandstone. So no, uh, not clear what the uh, phosphorite is for, and just on the off chance that it does something that I don't want. I'm going to make a separate um, storage bin for that. Uh, if anybody knows what phosphorite is used for, please, uh, please let me know in the comments. That would be very useful information. So I might have destroyed this. Yeah, so this is no longer a great hole because uh, it's now too large. So let's fix that problem. Um, so we want one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, and then the doors there. Okay, let's, uh, there we go. Cool. Uh, this will store hmm. raw mineral. Nope. Metal ore? No, I didn't think so. Where would we find? Oh, phosphorite. Okay, so it's used in agriculture. Interesting. Um, anyway, that stuff that's up here can now all be swept up. Um, I'm going to prioritize getting those doors built, um, so otherwise they don't get the uh, morale bonus for the uh, for the mess hall. We have the insulated tiles, so I am going to put those in all the way along there, and also there. Don't want those bedrooms getting too toasty, and they are very toasty. Um, okay, so then we're going to want to think about our... Um, I think that's correct. I always I always screw this up. I, I can never remember how I'm supposed to build the uh, the water seal. Um, so let's just cancel that for a second. Cancel that for a second. Then, oh, that's going to be a problem. Let's urgently build that ladder because otherwise they're going to get stuck. Um, oh, in fact, they're already stuck. Oh, not quite, but still. <laughs> Definitely don't want that to be come a problem. So let's also dig those out. Um, good, good, good. Okay. And then we want to build insulated tiles here, here, and here. Oh, I didn't mean to do those high priority. Let's pop that back down. Do you know what? I shouldn't have been building out of granite, really. Overheat temp. Actually, no. That's yeah. That's that's fine. That will work. And then quite sure how far we want that to go out. So let's just 
build what we need for now. Um, great. So that's the, the beginnings of the clean room. That yellow alert will go as soon as they've built those uh, insulated tiles. Good. Okay, uh, research. Let's get the um, the research that we cancelled going again. So, oh, it didn't even start the plumbing, so that's fine. Plumbing on the go. Do we have our mess hall back? We do. Good. Um, yeah, as I said, we're going to want bedrooms um, on the other side if we want to bring in more dupes. So let's also start kind of filling this side out. We'll just do four of those for now. And we'll dig out as much as we can. Well, not as much as we can, but some. Um, Cool. Slowly, slowly starting to take shape. Um, so we want one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Gap. And then we want the ladder for this side of the base going in. Ah, oh, damn it. I think it was there. Um, oops, a daisy. Let's get rid of those. How's the old oxygen doing? Okay, good now. Yes, yeah, so we because we released this and we're also producing oxygen. Oxygen is uh, very much plentiful at this stage, so that's very nice. Let's uh, get those doors set as they should be. Um, also going to want to dig that stuff out, so let's just get that going as well. We've got a lot of projects on the go at the moment. Um, clean rooms, obviously, going to be one of the bigger ones. What with uh, all those insulated tiles, which take quite a, quite a long time to uh, to build. Uh, they can't start doing this ladder until some of that's removed. So let's uh, dig those out. Hey, excellent. Everybody's got something to do. Uh, no more mealwood seeds, which is a bit of a shame. We'll have to... Oh, in fact, oh, that's bristle blossoms and muck roots. Oh, yeah, there's some mealwood there, so we'll be able to access that very soon. Right, let's have a look. Um... Let's see what it's offering us. I don't want to bring in another dupe yet, so we'll just take that algae. Um, can't hurt to have algae. So everything's ticking along quite nicely. I mean, to be already starting to think about the clean room at cycle 10. So it's, uh, it's going well. Um, let's also dig this out. As I said, I want this to be another bedroom um, at some point. So... We can start uh, 
we, we can start to get it built out. Is that right? Yes, it is. Ooh. Um, cool. I suppose we can actually put the bed in as well. The other bed is going to go there. And then, once again, we'll have medicine for wash basin. So we'll have gap, then door, then wash basin, and then finally plumbing, outhouse, in you go. So that's the next bedroom kind of planned out. They'll get to it as and when. It's not massive priority, so not too bothered. However, those insulated tiles do really need to get done ASAP. So I'm going to set all of those to priority nine. Because the temperature, oof, that is really not good. They have got very, yeah, in fact, it's actually waking Rambo Chicken up in the middle of the night. Now, there's not going to be a quick and easy way to fix that. It's just going to get better as time goes by once those insulated tiles go in. So it will keep the heat on this side. And I think the, the rest of the base is quite cool, so it should start to cool down the bedrooms, in theory. Um, we'll find that out. Yeah, they're 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 really going going at it now with the um, with the insulated tiles. Hey, all the research is done. So the next thing will be gas. Uh, gas is no, that's power. Actually, I do kind of want the larger battery, so let's just get the first part of um, power done. Let's get rid of that and all of these. And yeah, they're they're all really going at it to get that floor done. So temperature should stop being an issue. Um, we've got idle people. Oh no, that's just because he's stuck. It's the only reason why. Okay, let's also just start putting the correct flooring in around here. I'm just going to leave the ones under the bed for now because we're halfway through the day. Um, and I actually let's let's do that one at least. Because uh, when you dig the things out from under the bed, it means that the dupes can't use the bed until whatever, uh, like the flooring is put back in. Uh, so yeah, you want to make sure that that's all set up uh, before bedtime. Okay, let's put in just a little bit more of the flooring there, and also a couple more bins because they are starting to get full. How are we doing? So they've not even got over to over here yet, um, which is fine. Not a problem at all. Um, okay, we can put some uh, blossom seeds in. Let's just double check how far the light goes on this side. So on this side, it only goes out two. Um, so that's okay. We've got two bristle blossoms there. And then we'll get mealwood seeds in those two. Food's holding up pretty well. It was at around about 22,000 last time I looked at it, and that was at least like three or four cycles ago. So the fact that it's only gone down by about 500 uh, means that this very, very, very small farm uh, is just about holding its own at the moment. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, so I did do that correctly. That's a relief. <laughs> um, slowly building up there. This is really starting to take shape. Um, now, what? Ah, they're not going to be able to... B 
build. In fact, let's just put in some temporary ladders along here so that they uh, they build that ceiling. <laughs> Should be enough. And we will copy the settings from here. Frosted the new uh, the new bins, and now they're working. Let's also finish off the tiles here. So the, the reason I'm doing that is because, as you can now see, the bedrooms are nice and clean, um, and that helps improve the decor uh, in those rooms. So you can see there's just like a tiny little inkling of green there, and that's because there's no um, no debris on the floor. Whereas here, ah, it's hideous. People sleeping in these rooms hate us right now. Um, but that, that, that will solve itself. And also, because I've let all the stuff drop down, the route from the debris to the storage bins is a lot shorter. So it's kind of helped that out too. Uh, right, we have a problem here in that that needs to be sealing. But do you know what? Let's uh, just wall all of that off. Yeah, they they couldn't build the uh, the ceiling um, tiles because yeah, they just can't reach it from the floor. They can uh, they can construct things that are four tiles above them, but not five. So yeah, one. Oh, sorry, three tiles above them, but not four, rather. Cool. Um, how's the research? Nothing on at the moment. So one thing that I've just thought about that would be good is to have the fire poles. So let's get those things on the go next. Um, let's get these rooms over here kind of set up with the doors. Um, we'll go ahead and dig all of that out. And whenever they're ready, stick a couple of storage bins on this side as well. Right, let's let's see if we can just kind of tidy those bedrooms up a bit. Um, it's not ideal that they're sleeping in such chaos. So how's the temperature situation? It's got a little bit better, to be fair. That was turning quite... It, it was about 31, 32 degrees before all the insulated tiles. So you can see it is, mm, I mean, it's going up a little bit. But it, it's better than it was. Much better than it was. Uh, oxygen, uh, apparently the oxygen generation isn't sufficient, but I would say that's pretty sufficient. We've got, uh, got breathable atmosphere all the way down <laughs> to the bottom here. Uh, so, yeah, I am not worried about that. Oxygen is not a problem. Um, let's... Again, just kind of filling in little vanity projects as I'm going as well. Um, so do we need to build that floor? Absolutely not, but it does... Uh, again, it will help all of these materials to kind of fall down to uh, lower levels and make it a little bit easier to, to clear up. Um, eventually, I'm going to want to move that CO2 trap into the hall over here. Um, so I might start thinking about that sometime soon. Um, Hector's got another point. Um, I don't really need to give him another cooking thing at the moment. So let's see. Is he passionate about anything else? Not particularly. Um, hmm. Let's just have him good with tidying. But let's put his tidying hat on. We don't need him to be a 
chef right now, so we'll get his improved strength hat on. Uh, we can deconstruct those two now. And we will also, again, want all of this swept up. Let's copy these settings over to the one bin that has been built. So there's uh, there's plenty for them to be getting on with. So um, I'm just going to let it uh, take over. Just deal with other things as and when they pop up. So new principles. Um, let's see. I mean, we have got bedrooms set up now, so maybe another person is not a bad idea. We don't need another researcher. We don't need another researcher. He's got fantastic athletics, but unfortunately, uh, well, he's not good at planting things. That's OK. Can't do cooking things. Well, we've already got a cook. But narcoleptic, I don't want that whatsoever. So we're just going to go with the resources instead. Yeah, I'm not averse to uh, bringing in new dupes, but they've got to be useful. Um, there's no point just bringing people in for the sake of it. Um, okay, the research... What is he researching? So that last uh, bit there, so we can get the fireman poles. So that uh, I'll get those building uh, as soon as the research is finished. Not too far to go. Hey, okay, there we go. So let's get our fire poles going in and we'll do them on the outside all the way down. Cool. So getting down from up here should be a lot simpler in the future. those bins sorted out. Um, we do need the gases done because we're going to want to start thinking about getting that clean room chlorinated in the non too distant future. Um, so where is that stuff? That's all uh, gases. Here we go. Um, so oh, in fact, you know what? I think we've actually already got everything that we need. Let's get that going, because I would like to get the uh, deodorizer going at some point. One thing that I could really do with um, sorting out is the um, looted dirt. So the outhouses, if I can hover in the right place and zoom out far enough so to be able to actually see. Oh no, there's no polluted dirt yet, which is surprising. I would have thought that the be some polluted dirt by the outhouse by now. Uh, um, oh, yeah, okay, so there is some polluted dirt there. I am now worried that they're putting polluted dirt into the bins. So let's just double check that that's not the case because we do not want polluted dirt going in here and sullying all of our other uh, materials. Um, thankfully, it's not. That's good. Um, just double check everything else that it is putting in here, though. Um, organics. Ah, so, yeah, that's why it's not putting them in here, because we've got organics all turned off. We don't want organics in this uh, section here. Good. Um, so, polluted dirt, yes. How do we want to deal with that? Well, it does produce a little bit of heat. Since this area is hot already, I say that we build build a little ladder up we dig out a little bit of this say that much um, and we'll just cancel that one there but we are gonna have to dig out 
that there as well, and that, and that. Cool, that should be fine. We've got plenty to be getting on with. That fireman's pole is slowly getting there. They've still got the rest of this bedroom to dig out. Um, they've now got this little project for the polluted dirt to be dealt with. Um, yeah, everything's ticking along really, really nicely. Um, again, little vanity projects. Let's get those filled in. Just because my OCD is going over time with it not looking nice. Um, how are we doing seeds-wise? So we've got more blossom seeds. So what I could do with figuring out is... Uh, let's just put in some temporary ladders so that it can get over to the place that we need it to be and then we'll put in a couple more farm tiles um definitely there maybe there um that remains to be seen but we'll definitely dig out all of that that Cool, that's all dug out. That was very quick. Um, so I'm gonna put a manual airlock here and refinement compost heap. We'll put that in there. Um, this is gonna produce uh, polluted oxygen, which is why I'm putting in the manual airlock rather than the normal pneumatic doors. Um, try and keep that polluted oxygen in there as much as we possibly can. I'll eventually put a deodorizer there and then just get rid of the airlock. But um, yeah, the deodorizers, uh, they never used to, they, they just used to require dirt, I think. Uh, but now they also require power as well. Um, I, I don't know how long that's been the case. And it could be that I'm, I've, I've just not played this game in such a long time that They've needed power for ages and ages at this stage. Um, I I don't quite know, but uh, yeah, regardless, they they do need power now, so um, they do need to get. Uh, I I need a better power source than just this wheel. This wheel will run just this system here, and in fact, it doesn't fully run this system here. Um, if it's uh, if you've got like the research station, the oxygen diffuser and the supercomputer running at the same time, you would need somebody running in this wheel constantly. And even so, it still wouldn't be producing enough power. Uh, thankfully, we only have one researcher, so it's either using the research station or the advanced computer. Um, and then the oxygen diffuser is always going in the background. So that's why that system works. Um, but we can't add anything else to it, really. Um, so we're quite limited with that. Anyway, um, what do we need next? Um, hmm. I suppose it's more of a what do I want to do next rather than what... Oh, actually, no, we absolutely need a water sieve, so let's get that going. Um, yep, yeah, cool. Let's just leave it to get going with that. This should become a priority relatively soon because everything else... So we've got the fireman pole done. There's a couple more insulated tiles to go in there, but um, you know this this clean room is slowly getting there. Um, do you think it's not going to be quite long enough? We're probably going to have to dig out a little bit further. So do you know what? So um, may as well put the task on. Because um, the other thing I'm going to want to do is kind of put in a manual airlock here space another manual airlock and then start digging into this chlorine room um mind you if the chlorine's going into here don't really need all of that airlock system um might just be better to let all the chlorine flow in naturally i don't know i'll decide that at a later stage okay manual airlock I don't want everybody going in here and dealing with this compost heap. So what I'm going to do is set it as a default to locked. With, oh, hold on. Um, no, I want everybody, everybody to be able to go out. 
how do we do this? No, hold on. Um, door is on auto. So waiting duplicate. No, we don't want it open all the time. We want it to auto. Then we want everybody allowed to go through that way in case they get trapped. But we don't want everybody going into that room. Uh, the one person that we do want going into that room, I believe it was Hex, because I gave him improved strength. But everybody else should be disallowed from going in there. Um, cool. That's that done. Although, that's a good point. What's the germ situation with him? Ooh. Hmm, that's a problem. He's covered in germs. He'll drop that off and he's still covered in germs. Oh, that was a big mistake. I should have put the compost heap a little bit further along and put a couple of wash basins in there. Ah, damn. Damn, 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 damn. Ooh, I've screwed up a bit there. I've definitely screwed up a bit. Um, hmm. How do I want to deal with this? Uh, there's no good way of dealing with it other than just to deconstruct. Oh, I'm, I need to send him to go and wash his hands like immediately. So I'm going to tell him manually to go to the other side of that wash basin. So that he'll come back through and wash all those germs off. So he's not spreading them all over the base. Um, but yeah, that needs to get deconstructed. I don't see a, another way around it. Um, so let's dig this out a little bit further. I'm going to put two wash basins and then the compost heap. And I'm going to have to change all of those restrictions just for a little while so that uh, this can all get dealt with. So the sweeping up tasks are starting to get done. Um, right, let's go riff. No, plumbing. Yeah, no, not plumbing. Furniture, medicine, medicine, wash basins. So we want two wash basins just to be safe then we want uh refinement compost and put that back in so once this is all built i will then change the restrictions back to what it was just hex being allowed in um in fact do you know what i don't want the manual airlock to block people from getting to this wash basin because otherwise only hex can fill them up with water so do you know what i am going to de deconstruct that too and we'll put it on the other side uh and we'll also need a tile on the top Okay, there we go. Oh, yeah, we need to set the wash basin so it's only when they go to the left of it that they wash their hands. And as soon as this manual airlock is done, we will set up the priorities again good so we want everybody to be able to go left but only hex to go to the right excellent so that's all set up correctly now good 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 um hey oh uh they got built quite a while ago and i did nothing with them so let's check the light situation so oh in fact yeah so let's do another farm tile here and i don't know why i'm paused because there's no need to be um we'll do blossom seeds out to there 
Uh, we've got a couple more mealwood seeds, so I'm going to throw in a couple more farm tiles along here. Um, excellent. Ooh, food situation is diabolical. Only 9,000 food. That is not good. We really need this farm to expand rapidly. Um, right, let's uproot that. Do we have any other seed types? Let's just cancel that for now since it's not been done. Ugh, no. Um, oh dear. We, we might get through this unscathed. That's a big might, though, rather than a... We will! <laughs> um, I mean, I suppose I could go and kind of collect those things up there as well. In fact, I think I have to. Um, let's try and get out ahead of this food situation rather than just uh, bury our head in the sand. Um, so we'll dig up to there, get all of that stuff. Um, what's this? A sage hatchling egg. Um, not really any other seeds or plants that I can go for easily. I mean, there's a, there's a couple over here, but not a lot. Um, uh, okay, back up to ten thousand. It's it's not it's not in the most horrendous situation ever. Okay, let's have a look. What can we print? Um, briar seeds, myrtle leaf seeds. Uh, we do need a rancher at some point, but allergic to floral scent, I don't like that because they have to run through the through the farm all the time, and he'll just start sneezing every time he does. So I don't really want that. Um, don't need a researcher, so bubbles is out. Okay. Um, I don't really want either of those seeds, but I suppose I'll go for myrtle myrth leaf seeds. Okay, so they are starting to do a little bit of this bedroom now. And the main reason it's not doing any of it is because I hadn't set the dig order. Um, <laughs> so no wonder they've uh, they've just let this uh, carry on sitting here for ages and ages and ages. It was human error. Whoopsie. <laughs> Uh, right, let's go and uproot these plants. How are we doing for oxygen? Lovely, lovely, lovely stuff. Loads of it. Um, going to carry on building some ladders along here so that they can go in and do those um, insulated ceiling tiles. Yeah, they'll need to do it along the floor as well, so may as well. Um, now, in terms of where I'm going to put the polluted water, that... I mean, I'm considered, considering doing it here. Um, it's just not particularly accessible. Um, what's the temperature? Oh, no, the temperature's... Uh, the temperature's not too bad here, I suppose. So, yeah, if I put kind of like a an airlock door into here, then the polluted water tank here, and then it will get kind of processed into here, then it will come out into a pool. Hmm. I don't know where the pool's going to go, actually. It's another decision I've got to make. Um, I might try and make, like, make a manufactured pool here. Um, we'll have to wall this off, because uh, the temperature gets a little bit gnarly there. Um, How's the germ situation? No germs, so that's good. Um, cool. So yeah, I think that's where our pool's going to go. It'll 
the clean water pool will go here. Um, the polluted water pool will weirdly go right above it. Now, it'll never be a problem because I'll never deconstruct the, the floor tiles of a polluted water tank. But yeah, it's uh, perhaps not the safest place to be putting it. <laughs> Okay, may as well get these doors going in as well. Okay, this bedroom slash bathroom is all set up now. Um, great. So we can start, oh, in fact, yeah, look at the food now, 16K. Yeah, we can definitely bring in another dupe as soon as it gives us a decent one. Um, until then, I've just got to kind of live with what we've got. Hmm. I suppose, yeah really now yeah i need to start getting this chlorine to start coming in I suppose not until all of that's built so I'm just gonna put a priority seven on those see if that will encourage them to come and start building it up um i will need to put in some bottle empties here so let's get that done um so bottle emptier, bottle emptier, 